What's up, everybody? Listen, we 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 about to hop right into it because y'all already know what we've been going through, and this is the thing that I've been wanting to talk about. I did cover this issue earlier this year when this happened but the fact of so much has been going on after this virus has hit the united states of america i want to give my thoughts what i think and what i feel about this whole situation because it just don't make no sense um first of all let's just say 2020 is a brand new decade a brand new decade is specifically for the new generation of people that are around my age and a little younger than me to like we are the ones that's going to start the new cycles and start having children i don't have any kids and not planning on having any uh but you know you never know what happens 2020 is a year to remember there has been a lot of deaths there's been a lot of um, what do you call it? Um, yeah, disasters. There's been a lot of chaos going on and explosions and and what else has been going on? The, the coronavirus, the election, the just all that stuff. And we need somebody and who, who, whoever that passes bills and laws and things like that we need somebody that's in there that knows how to that know that has some sense and that has faith and believes in god and that knows actual word now i'm not saying that i live completely right i'm not going to sit on this camera and say that but what i am going to say is we need somebody that knows what they're doing and that's that and that's a, a real person that makes wonderful decisions because I know everybody is, somebody is over this person, and then that person is over this person. You know, it's just the way that laws were made. I think some of them make sense, and some of them are unfair. I don't know too much about amendments and laws and Congress and all that things, but I'm starting to learn, and I've been doing my research. 2020 has been a big year. It's been a big deal. A lot of racism been going on. It's a lot of undercover racism going on. Uh, that's been going on for years but specifically for this virus i do feel like that the virus was somehow set up in a certain type of way uh i do feel like because my whole thing is why now you know what i'm saying you, you would have think it would have been out why now why now why why did people have to lose jobs you know i know that it hit so fast but why did it have to happen like that I do, in the deepest part of my soul, do think that it was a setup. I do think that it was a, it may have, it may have been a scam for some companies to make more money as far as cleaning companies and as far as um, companies that, um, that have to work like Amazon and UPS and USPS. I mean, because those people are working 10 times harder to do whatever, whatever they need to do. And whoever owns them are making their coin. No checks have stopped for people that has easier jobs like work from home jobs or store jobs or anything like that. They may have been affected in a way. Hours may have been cut. This is going to be a year that I may have to look back at and be like, you know what? This year, will, this year was something to remember. I would have to say that I am blessed enough to still be able to work, make money, do whatever I need to do and survive. I want to say I'm blessed and I hope that everyone out there is just still making it. And, and if you're not, we just pray like in the name of Jesus that you can make it and you can you can pull through this and you can do whatever you need to do and use your resources to do what you need to do and then it happened around and then the election time was coming i just knew that it was going to be a some mess we're going to see how it is when the president gets in and see what you know what he got 
It's been hectic. The vaccine, what do I think about that? I do feel like they definitely are rushing it. I mean, even though it has been almost, well, a good year since it's been known to be out, especially when it's supposedly starting in China. I don't know how true that is. We'll have to see how the vaccine does and if it's really effective. We just have to get the thoughts on, on some people. Maybe you, you might not feel nothing when you take it. You know, because when I took the flu shot, it made me feel bad a day later and I was back to normal. But this year is, mm, I hope 2021 is better, but I think we as a, just a nation have to do better in how we live and what we do. I think if we do better in things that we do, a lot of things will flow by a lot more smoother. We just have to do right by living and make the right decisions. And that's just how I feel about it. And that's just that on that.